Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in to this episode of Last Cast Adventures. So, today is one of those days where it's just too windy to really get on a boat, get on a kayak, do anything like that. Just the winds just blowing, the nice uh, wintertime winds. So, went to the bridge near my house and uh, went out with those uh, you know, little DOA shrimps I like to use so much. And caught, a, you know, caught dinner, caught a couple of cool different species, and caught a decent amount of fish. So, it was a good time. Um, Sometimes you don't even need bait, you just need to find the right spot where the water's not so rough and the wind's not blowing so much and you just fish the bait the right way and it works out. So, thanks guys, hope you enjoy. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet, I appreciate it. And uh, tight lines guys. That's a nice one. Another mangrove. Yeah, he's he might be 13. It's your lucky day. I'm not keeping unless you're like big. <laughs> yeah, you just you Oof, okay, he didn't hit a rock. Ah, uh, he popped me. It was big, and he took me right, I think he took me into a hole. I don't know if it was a cuda or not. I don't know, that was nice. Yeah. Right. I got a fish, yeah. He's not as big. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, he's probably maybe just 10, maybe 11, but yeah. Ooh, that's a nice mangrove. Ooh. All right, I got her off the rocks. Got her here. Well, she's not as nice as I thought. Swinging up. Hey, there we go. All right, this one will come home. Nice. That's about a 15 incher. You know, all the little guys um, try to hit it and they can't because it's, you know, slightly too big, so most of them can't hit it. And then the, uh, the bigger guy gets fed up with all the little guys hitting it. So he comes up and eats it and, you know, he can eat it. And at that point, he's not really, he's throwing caution to the wind because he's just seeing food that's getting away from the small guys so then he comes up and he eats it and then I hook him yep he's about 15 eh, 14 and a half to 15 hey there we go normally through the mouth doesn't work but in this case it did okay now I've got him whoop falling Alright, let me, let me put you out of your, your misery here, but, okay. So, since the water is probably cold, I'm going to leave him right there, tie it to this stick here, and we are going to be golden. Oh, that was a hit. I don't know if it was a big one or not. Oh, there we go. Uh, maybe. Is it maybe worth keeping? And 
and just not. <laughs> He's 10, maybe 11, but I don't want to deal with it. There's just not enough meat. Oh, he dug himself in. Ooh, this is a big fish. This is a big fish. I mean, oh, I don't even have a mask with me. Do I jump in and go after it? Oh, man, that was like, oh, no. He might be off. Oh, nope, he's still on. Oh. oh, there he is. My, it's a grouper. Wow. That's cool. Got him. Well, I got him to shore. He's not huge, but he's... Wow, that's cool. No, it's not season anyway. I would have been upset. I would have went in there with the spear gun and been like, oh, I can't even shoot it. <laughs> That's cool. Uh, probably 17, 18 inches. And there she goes. Sweet. And there's a mangrove. Next cast. Wow, he is beautiful. He was really, really pink on the bottom, but he's like six inches. No pen battle three, 2500 holding up the grouper and kudas and, and snapper and I think that's about it. I think that's all I've caught on, on it so far. Ooh. Dang, he hit that hard. Wow, you looked. You looked much bigger. Much bigger, friend. Lucky day for you. He's keeper, but not the kind I want to keep. Not the size. Anybody know what all these black spots are? Not bad. No. Wood is heavy. I wasn't expecting the wood to be so heavy. <laughs> <laughs> 